on my bucket list for many years has been riding the Cumbras and Toltec train on the border of Colorado and New Mexico. Laura was happy to join me as she started her summer vacation. It is the longest and highest narrow gauge steam train ride currently operating in the United States. Built to support the mining industry of the 1800s, it delights present day train enthusiasts like me. I was told that our steam engine went online in 1903 making me 46 years younger than the engine pulling us up the mountain. The ride reminded me of the Chota Line, Hindi for narrow gauge, that my brother and I rode to school in India. The trip to and from school each year took four days and three nights. Winding slowly through the hills of central India, our Chota Line took nine hours to traverse the 120 miles to the nearest station to our village. Narrow gauge means three feet between the rails instead of the more common standard gauge of four feet eight and a half inches between the rails. The narrow gauge enabled our Cumbras and Toltec train to make tighter kerns in the mountains, which considerably reduced the initial construction costs. The track took us up a 4% steep grade from Chama, New Mexico, over the 10,015 foot Cumbras Pass, and down through the spectacular Toltec Gorge. For our seven hour train ride, we boarded the train in Chama, stopped halfway for lunch, and continued on to our destination of Antonito, Colorado. Winding along the border of the two states, sometimes it would be only a matter of minutes between leaving Colorado, entering New Mexico, and returning to Colorado. It has been 60 years or so since I have had coal cinders in my hair. Far too long a time. I thoroughly enjoyed the trip. <laughs> 